Hi and welcome to Mark's Motivational Podcast for the Sunday episode, Music Sunday. Thanks a lot for joining me on the podcast this evening. Um, so uh, I just want to start by uh, thanking everybody who's come on the podcast since this began. Um, God, nearly, got to, nearly two years ago now. So it's been a great experience for me and I hope it's been great for the listeners as well. And now you can watch it on YouTube as well. So um, thanks for everybody that's, that's watching on YouTube as well. So um, like a good variety of guests on the podcast, as you probably notice when you're looking through them, of authors, singers, songwriters, um, <clears throat> people around uh, neuro-linguistic programming, coaches, and some really good tips for people to check it out. So make sure you check out these episodes. So I'll probably start um, today's podcast. I'm going to have another author on the podcast on Tuesday, Authors Tuesday. Um, Sylvia Milton, um, her name is, so I'm looking forward to that, to um, promote her books. So I just want to give my, my book a mention there tonight. As a lot of you might know, I, I wrote a book um, last year in the middle of lockdown. These, these books, um, these, these stories um, are a collection of short stories I made up for the children, bedtime stories I made up for the children through the, uh, through the, year, through the years. Um, so uh, I, I got motivated by that. Um, I had all these stories, so I decided to put them into book and self-publish them on Amazon. And uh, this is the book here, um, if you're watching on YouTube, it's The Adventures of Larry Lampos and Friends. And my daughter, um, she's done a picture of the front, front cover. So I got that done um, on uh, Fiverr. Um, it's a really good good site for people to do covers for your book and all that. Just give them a plug. Really, really good. Um, I found it great. I just sent what I had, the picture I had, and he put um, put it all together. <clears throat> so um, there's the book itself... Um, it starts off with Larry Lampost and uh, tells the story of him going to school and the problems he has uh, bumping into lampposts all the, all the time. And he has other brothers um, as well that um, that have the same problem. And he's coming back from school and he questions the lamppost the next day. And the next day, the same thing is, happens to his brother. I suppose like, please don't tell the rest of the brothers. He doesn't care that he's not to be in a court. But he's more concerned with the rest of them um, slagging him and making fun of him. So, um <clears throat> That's the first story, and then there's Mister Shopper. Uh, it's a story about um this this guy, and he's a he's a big time shopper. He loves shopping. He shops every day, <clears throat> and um he wakes up one early one morning and he flies into town and he realizes, hey, what's going on? All the shops are closed, and um he doesn't realize it was Christmas Day, so he felt terrible. Went home and apologized to his family for leaving them on Christmas Day, and um it goes to his family then. And uh, there's, there's just little stories like that. They're, they're fun, fun stories that my kids loved, you know, as <clears throat> growing up. And then the best thing about it is I've got um, a four-year-old now, so I've been making up stories for him. So I've got to, um, it, there's a sequel coming out as well. So this this book is available on Amazon, um, Amazon Kindle. If you want to check it out, The Adventures of Larry Lampos and Friends. And um, yeah, so I'm, I'm, I'm just, doing some work on finishing it off. So the book book format will be available soon, hopefully. So hopefully before Christmas. And then um, I'll, I'll definitely put a link to it on the, the show notes uh, for people to check out. I really appreciate it. If you just even download a free version, just have a listen or have a read and see what you think. Like the best thing about it is like, it can be read to young children, like bedtime, bedtime stories. But um, like I, I, a friend of mine, um, Tony Gordon, he bought it for his his um his his niece, and um he was saying it was great for for um his sister to read read um his her daughter the the story, but then it was, he had he has an older son, so he's able to read it as well and get the the different funny things about us. And there's little subtle um subtle hints for the, for kids to deal with um all kinds of bullying and stuff like that. I try and put subtle things in as well in the stories um as I go along as well. So um, just little, little, little helpful tips um, embedded in the story. I find that really good and to help help children, you know, help people. So um, so that that's the story there. That's that's the name. But it's 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 called again the adventures of Larry Lampost and friends. Um, I really love the cover that that Kate done was was really really good. It's great that she got involved in it as well. So that, that's brilliant. Like you know, it's great to catch our children involved and in stuff, the stuff like that, because it motivates them to think of stuff that they can do themselves. So I think that's that's really really helpful as well. So um, thanks a lot for that. I just wanted to uh, let you know about my book a little bit about it. So 
if you have any questions about it, just send me a quick email um, at marklessdrying11 at hotmail.com um, and uh, I'll be able to answer them for you. And uh, as I said, stay tuned for Tuesday. We're going to have um, another author on, on, the, on the podcast, Sylvia, Sylvia Milton. So seeing as it's Music Sunday as well, I'll probably just do a quick song that I wrote um, last year. It's called, um, it's called Empty Streets and I hope you like it. Okay, here we go. So yeah, so this is Empty Streets. Uh, thanks for tuning in tonight. And um, as I say, like we're gonna have Authors Tuesday on uh, next Tuesday. Um, I have a good few authors lined up to come on the show over the next couple of weeks. So um, thanks everybody who's who's got in touch with me on um, on uh, Messenger and email me to say they want to come on. So that's brilliant. Um, so it's great to be able to help authors out as as we go, as you say. So um, this is called Empty Streets. Goes like this. Empty streets, empty streets. We walk down empty streets today, today. Waiting for a train. Waiting for a plane, waiting for your day to begin. Empty streets, empty streets, you. Today, today, what's wrong with fun, what's wrong with laughter, why does everything have to feel with hate, feel with pain? song called empty streets that's just two versions two verses of the the song there um so uh listen thanks a million for tuning in today uh to the music sunday where i am I, um, I just gave you a little basic rundown of my book my own book adventures of larry lamppost and done the one song empty streets i hope you enjoyed that song as well um <clears throat> i really miss um jamming with the band as well hopefully we get that doing that again soon it's just brilliant doing some of these songs um with, with with the band it's brilliant you know and um <clears throat> yeah so listen uh thanks you can check out a lot of my our stuff we do uh, we have a, a band called the crafty clowns as some of you might know um i put some of um our gigs on on, on my youtube channel and uh, where you're watching this on youtube and um and if you listen on spotify check out uh, my youtube channel and uh, mark Strange's uh youtube channel so um so that's it um so stay tuned next week. Um, we're gonna hopefully have somebody else on Music Sunday, like um, I think John Mullins will hopefully come on. Um, John Mullen, and he's the bass player in the band. He's a really good, he's a brilliant singer songwriter. Um, he's wrote a really good song called Rainy Night in Dublin. You gotta hear that that song. It's absolutely brilliant. Like I've shared some of his songs on on uh, Music Sunday as well, and we done a um done a uh, podcast 
I think it was last season, um, based around the um, based around an album that they did um, in a, a singer songwriter's night in the Dain Tavern. Um, you gotta check it out. It's um, it's last season. Uh, some really good songs in that album. So um, check it out. Okay, so listen. Um, I hope you have a great week, and um, we'll talk to you uh, real soon. We'll talk to you on Tuesday on the podcast. Take care. Thanks for tuning in.